in this lesson, I want to show you how to add the pricing page block. So you create a website and you have your prices ready and you're trying to figure out what format to put or how to put it there. Well, the grid box already has predefined pricing structure that you can use based on the number of packages that you're going for. So if you have something that has these two packages, you can drag this one here and pretty much just change the name of it and you can link all of this uh, to wherever you want them to go. So that one is a nice one here. I'm going to come over and let's say choose something else. So you have, you can choose different styles too, which I love about uh, the, the page blocks here. So if you're going to go over a format like this, that's a little more. And let's say that you have, you want to add a little more. Right now they have one, two, three, four, five, six, about five of them. So you want to keep adding another package. You put your mouse over here, you just click on clone it or copy and then just change whatever content that you want to change on here. You want to change the text. Um, 879 or whatever you know you want it to be you can either click on that if you don't want it you come and you click on delete you come back here and you can choose another option this option here and that's at the very top so this is a really really cool way for you to add pricing on your website um, normally you know you'd have to get extra extensions and things like that to be able to create just specifically for the pricing but they've done a really awesome job of you know creating something for you and all you have to do is just drag and drop to add it on your page and you're good and ready to start accepting payments.